A lot of students ask about the personality development and self-assessment. Now here comes what is personality development. Um, a lot of uh, students are in a confusion to intermingle with personality development with the, the status of wealth and status of uh, education and status of bank and balance, but it is a very wrong perception. Personality development, a balanced and a developed personality is that which having some worth in this civilized world, which we used to say that this is a personality which we can say that this is an ideal personality which we can follow so for a balanced personality there are a certain um, elements which are involved for a, a personality development the first and foremost is self-assessment uh, you know you have to assess yourself with with uh, a just and fair you know assessment during uh, assessment you have to be very fair about yourself you know you don't uh, exaggerate you don't underestimate yourself you have to be a realistic your as in, in your assessment for example if you want to do something then uh, assess yourself can I do this do I have capabilities to do that if I have then I should go if I don't have the capabilities I shouldn't step in so this is the idea of self-assessment the second is uh, the self-respect if you don't respect yourself, nobody gonna respect you, is the saying of a famous critics. So always respect yourself. If you if you want to flourish, if you want to progress in this world, then try to respect yourself. Try to give some worth to yourself, then definitely the people, the other people will give you some worth. I, I um, have an example of a famous uh, American uh, uh, billionaire who said that uh, I never been to college and never Never been to university, but today in my company, 30,000 highly qualified um, male and females are doing a job. Um, because uh, they, they have much education, they have more experience, more wisdom than me, but they are doing job under, in my company because they, they, they don't have trust on their capabilities and they don't want to lose their job and I, they are doing the job uh, in my company and I, am, uh, I have that company. I never been to college and university, but today I develop because I had some, uh, I had trust on myself. I have, uh, you know, faith on myself. So this is an idea. The third and the last uh, uh, thing is always to set a goal and aim and objective in your life. Without aim and objective, life is nothing. I mean. If you don't uh, set your goal and um, if you don't set your aim and objective, then you're gonna do nothing in your life. Always set uh, a small goals and objectives. For example, if you do wanna do. Um, um, a very big exam then try to learn daily a few of the lessons slowly and slowly this will give you more energy this will give you more uh, confident within yourself that I have knowledge of this I have knowledge of this I have knowledge of this then slowly and gradually you will um, get more and more knowledge and one day you will be very proficient to clear that exam so these are the three Three step which I want to mention uh, for personality development in today's lesson. Thank you so much for being with me.